Hey, this is Pastor Steve from New Life Center Circle. Hope you're having a great Tuesday. Uh, we had a, just a powerful service on uh, Sunday. Uh, the Holy Spirit just moved. Um, there was a lot of ministry time. Pastor didn't get to his sermon. It was just a really good, powerful time um, in, in his presence. And I want to talk to you a little bit about what makes that possible sometimes. On Sundays, I try to be at church by uh, 1015 to set up all my gear, make sure it's working. We try to sound check by 1030 uh, and be done sound checking at 1045. And then from 1045 to 11 o'clock, as a team, we start worshiping. Um, and we do that to set an atmosphere in which the Holy Spirit can move and, and we're ready to move with him. But beyond that, every Sunday, um, in addition to that, uh, our awesome sound guy, George, and Pastor John Parker get here even earlier, sometimes as early as 9 o'clock, and they will start uh, playing worship music in the sanctuary. They walk, they pray, they worship themselves. So they set an atmosphere even for us, the worship team, as we come in. And a lot of times as I walk through those doors, I sense the presence of God already in this house uh, before we even get started. Um, and so I'll, they're creating atmosphere, and that's the goal, even from our 10.45 to 11 o'clock uh, segment, is the goal is to create atmosphere. And I want to uh, teach you a little simple thing about atmosphere. You carry an atmosphere with you. Um, a lot of times what happens is, as we get closer to that 11 o'clock mark, uh, as more people come in, the atmosphere gets mixed, and that's because they're, everybody's bringing in their own atmosphere with them. Some good, some bad. Um, so I want to encourage you that you prepare yourself um, before you come into church. You know, spend some time in prayer. Spend some time in, in worship and in the Word uh, before you come into church. And set your heart, purpose in your heart, to come in prepared to flow with whatever the Holy Spirit's doing. And when you do that, you bring that atmosphere with you. Because you're alive and living and he's alive in you. Um, that will just make uh, the services go that much higher because it's not all dependent on who's doing what ever on stage. It's dependent on what everybody's doing in the room because we're all the family of God. We're all filled with the Holy Spirit. We all have an impact on what can happen every service, every Sunday. And that includes you. So I want to encourage you uh, at the next service that you come to, whether Wednesday night, whether Sunday, uh, prepare your heart, purpose in your heart to prepare to bring a good atmosphere in with you and then to continue it into the service. Don't forget everything that's going on. We've got uh, a women's uh, uh, Bible study coming up at Sue Tigra's house. I know there's some youth events coming up. We have, um, I think it's, the third Tuesday of, of, of March, we're doing another prayer and intercessory night on a Tuesday night. Come on out. Those are powerful times. I'm sure I'm forgetting something, but just check it out online. Listen on the services, and you'll, you'll find out as we uh, open up every service what's going on. Hopefully, you have a great Tuesday. I hope you're having a great week. God bless you, and I'll see you at the next service.